What up? And welcome to another episode of What Are You Watching? The TV slash film segment of the channel. Back with another One Piece edition. Episode 1116 is out now. So as always, got to shout out the studio, Toy Animation. And got to give a shout out to the creator, Oda. Appreciate all parties involved. Another one of them episodes where felt like the 20 minutes were actually five but good episode they did some world building In the beginning of the episode we find out that a marine admiral t-bone has been executed and i think that ties in with the conversation surrounding cross guild now if you ask me in the beginning of the series this is something that wouldn't have happened but at this point of the story a lot of things have changed and it feels like there's civil unrest across the globe ties into the conversation that we see the ex-admiral having in the bar stating how cross guild's influence is becoming dangerous and it should be taken care of before it gets bigger and so the first half of the episode focuses on cross guild the union between crocodile mihawk and buggy we see crocodile explain in the episode how they want to build the area that's free from government touch and i think that's why we saw what went down in the beginning of the episode the civil unrest the people are suffering starvation and things like that and so people are trying to push back or find a different way to do things and it looks like people are gravitating towards cross guild and are trying to help them build this utopia so we're starting to see that the way the people in charge or the world government have been running things isn't necessarily working anymore and revolution might be on its way. We know that the Revolutionary Army is also making moves and that ties into the end of the episode because we finally get to lay eyes on Sabo. Shout out to my boy. Looked a little scary for him in the beginning of the season because he was on the island that got wiped out. But we know that Princess Vivi helped him out who was also missing. And so luckily Sabo was able to make it back home. And after we see that the Revolutionary Army is happy to see their main guy back, Sabo wants to have a conversation with Dragon and another important member saying that the information he's about to share is a danger to everybody. And he wants to speak about what happened at the Riviera. So I think that we're going to get some more confirmation about the way the world government has been running things and the dirty little tricks that they've been pulling. Obviously, if people are suffering, but there is kingdoms that are prospering, I think that the suffering of certain people are purposely done. Throughout the series, we've seen that there's been oppressed sections here and there, the fishmen and things like that. So I'm excited to learn about what Sabo's gonna tell them next week. But as always, let me know what you guys thought about the episode. Till next time, peace.